Bitcoin Oversimplified, brought to you by BitTruth, so let's begin. Bitcoin is a decentralized peer-to-peer -peer electronic cash system. Bitcoins are not controlled by any one entity or central bank, and allows users to send and receive it as a form of payment without the use of a third party. Bitcoin has been created by an anonymous user under the pseudonym of Satoshi Nakamoto in 2008 after the financial crisis. He released the system in 2009, and ever since, a growing community of people have started using it and adopting it. Bitcoins are held in a software called a Bitcoin wallet, which holds your Bitcoins. Each Bitcoin wallet has a series of private keys which are to be stored safely and not shared with anyone. Basically, your private keys allows the sending of Bitcoins just like the password allows access to your email. When a Bitcoin is sent, the transaction is recorded on a public ledger called a blockchain which is a database of every recorded transaction on the network and allows them to be divided into blocks. Each block contains thousands of transactions, and just like beads on a string, they form a chain, hence blockchain. Blockchain is run by a series of nodes, managed by network participants. They keep the blockchain secure and allow the validation of each transaction on the network. Bitcoins are created as a reward of a process called mining. The use of computers for solving complicated mathematical equations in exchange for small fractions of Bitcoin. Mining allows the validation of Bitcoin transactions on the network. This creates an economy that requires electricity use to create the digital currency just like electricity is used to mine for gold. A Bitcoin can be used in a multitude of ways, namely a currency that allows the purchase of goods and services, in the last few years, however, people have started buying Bitcoin to speculate on its price and leverage its volatility to make money, where some individuals name it the new digital gold. For a beginner, this is the simplest way to describe Bitcoin and everything associated with it at beginner level. Any further explanation may be deemed complicated and steer off into another topics. If you have any questions, leave them down in the comments down below. Goodbye!